Welcome in, welcome back. It is title night tonight. Appreciate you watching. This might be the end of the series tonight. Oh, look at this. Let me get this going here. Appreciate you watching. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Ranch, Dwayne, San, what's up, fellas? My computer's freezing back here. It's not good. That's not a good way to start it. This may be my bad luck. All right, I think we're back. At least we're getting there. All right, I think we're back. Oh, we're back. All right, we'll wait for some people to get in here. Here we go. It's time. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the main event. Let's get ready to rumble. to rock 13 and 0 Kentucky number three in the nation taking on Miami in Miami at the FedEx Orange Bowl appreciate the nine thumbs up tonight this might be the end of a series tonight Streamlabs is very upset I don't see my goals I don't see anything <laughs> seriously Come the hurricane. 100%. What's up, man? Go Niners. Welcome, everyone. Brad Nessler here for EA Sports with my co-host, Kirk Herbstreet, and the coach, Lee Corso. We hope you're as excited as we are for this one. If you compare these teams on paper, they really look to be pretty equal. Kirk, what do you think? You know, I think in a game like this, you need to look at the big playmakers. Kentucky has voiced some concerns this week about protecting their That's quarterback. So weird. I think one of the best ways to slow down a pass rush is to hand the ball off to your talented running back. Watch for them to feed the ball to him and win a close game here. Let me tell you what I think here. Kentucky is not ready for this game mentally. And let me say also, I don't think physically they match up well against these receivers. I think they're getting a bunch of yards through the air, and I think they lose this game, Kirk. Thanks, Kirk and Lee. Well, the team captains look like they're ready for the coin toss, so we'll send it down to the field. All 
All right, here we go. Miami wins the toss. We're going with the all-white unis tonight. Kentucky. I think these look really good. For the kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. Hold on a minute. Let me get a couple things fixed here real quick. This has just gone haywire. Copy. Yeah, Streamlabs just down. Hey, it's getting there. They did an update. They did an update. To love updates. They did an update. Yeah, I made it to the championship, USA. How about this? All right, time to time to play. My goodness, just wanted to get on. Not a real deep kick. Should be Have to run into a million issues. Appreciate the thumbs up already. There's Bast starting it off right. Yikes. <clears throat> Here we go. Set up this could be it. And Stubble 4 could be in the books. It's going to be a good Miami team, though. Oh, boy. And look at that. Down he goes. Play action goes nowhere. Kentucky likes to send the pressure early. They get home. Nine-yard loss. Yeah, Streamlabs is upset again. It's, they've updated something. I have to take a look at it all. Heaven forbid they leave it alone. Drops back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. He throws That's a pick. It. And they do a good job at swapping. Appreciate that the uh, right, likes Brad. tonight. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and is get his hand on it. Miami comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Pressure coming. Complete. There it is, three and out for the Wildcats. That's what you like to see from Kentucky. To start it off, we got a big super chat coming in. I see it lighting up the screen, man. Sean, you're unbelievable. Thanks, dude. He gets it off. Duffy calls for the fair catch. And now we get to see this offense. All wide everything. <laughs> Yes, sir. Here we go. Excellent Good stop for the Wildcats. The First and ten. Ace backfield. And run game, not going to get much here. A lot of speed on that hurricane side. Sports Network, what's up, man? Gain a one on the play. Ball on the 45-yard line. The Wildcats come out in the ace formation. He drops back. He pumps once. They're going to go deep to Duffy. Duffy oh, can't come up with it. They came close to giving up the score there. Yeah, but credit the defender. He did a third down a long. Reading the play and showing instinct to get a hand there to break the pass. Third down a long. Nice job. Third, third and nine. Let's we'll see if we can get something out of this. Like oh boy, the pressure's on. Pressure's on. He's gonna go ahead and scramble for the first down. He's gonna run out of bounds. Stay, stay healthy in this one. We don't need to lose quarterbacks. Only got two. Only got two. Could add another trophy to the wall tonight, boys. And this time a run up the middle. 25 ain't going to pick up much. Maybe two. She's not even an alert for the dono. Come on now. Jeepers. Come on. Why do you got to do this? Well, I'm out 
time out, time out. Right. Here's where the offense stands compared to the rest of the nation. Yeah, they sure are struggling when they have the ball. Nothing good right. seems to happen when they're on offense. Second and seven coming up here. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Kentucky lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass, looking. Fires in there to big tight end. Some people say he's an NFL. At the 21 yard line. NFL nice caliber. To the tight end. A good tight end, I believe he is. I is that he provides a nice big Hashtag for Jared. Yes, Jared Lorenzen. That's why we started this series. For Mr. Jared Lorenzen. It's first and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Yeah, you just go ahead and jump in on that portal. The Wildcat set up in the gun. Stepped up. He's looking. His receiver has it. And down he goes. I mean, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to uh, Boy, solid job there by the make a redeem of Deion Sanders, telling his team to jump in the portal. The to the open <laughs> Just go ahead and jump in that portal. I don't want you. Miami brings in their nickel package. Looks. I'm bringing my own QB. Oh, I threw it to the wrong one. Watch the middle. Oh. Well, he tried to thread the needle with that pass. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor Had a decision, touchdown. throwing into coverage. He Had a touchdown. Progression and find the second and third. Ninety-two percent on the season. Red zone scoring, phenomenal. This team. You're absolutely right, my friend. This offense knows how to close the deal and put points on the scoreboard. Let's take another look at that interception. Yeah, 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 pick. They'll take over. There we go. There we go. Let's go, defense. He drops back. Boom. Steps up in the pocket. Uh -oh. And it's caught. Nice job by the quarterback to hit the tight end for a decent game. Okay, this guy's not going to burn too many guys deep, but he's definitely a good possession guy who you can rely on. All right, come on, defense. Third and eight. Ball on the 18-yard line. Get another three and out here. Early turnover by the Wildcats. With three wide receivers. Back to pass. And another sack, man. Our defensive line is eating tonight. Boy, they got some major heat on the quarterback that time. Well, that's the whole goal of the defense. They're going to attack him by bringing multiple looks and blitzing from the linebackers in the secondary to try to confuse him. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. He gets it away. Great hang time. Almost four seconds. Duffy takes it at the 49. A little juke. Great job by the defense last time forcing the pick. I wouldn't be surprised to see a few runs here by the offense to start things off. They'll start this drive at the 48. The Wildcat come out in the ace formation. He's hit and got away, and he's taken down. They got four yards on that one. All right, Joey, here's your song request, buddy. I'll focus up.
face mask. Time, let's go. We got on the board. Here's the kick. Number 26. Appreciate you watching tonight. Yes, we have a loyalty point giveaway. Oh, Sean, I'll get your gift cards this weekend, too. By the way, that you've redeemed. <clears throat> Heads up. Yeah, Stumpy, how did the PS5 thing They'll come out? Here. Hopefully you got your three. money back. That's not good. 7 nothing Kentucky. And, they have three receivers bunch. and they're going to go with the QB draw. And he's taken down. Maybe QB power. Gained on the play. It goes nowhere. Click and scroll, I can't let you go. They say I'm addicted to go. Click and scroll, I can't let you And we, I was going to say, man, we shipped it that way. Looks like they're going to punt it Dang away it. here. Number 39. Uh, let's get ready to win another title. Let's add one. Let's add one. Chad is hyped tonight. It's been so long, long hard days. They don't First and ten. Trying to fall on the fifty. 
trying to keep it uh keep it calm man it's easy to get away oh yikes good blocking he's under pressure oh gosh oh Dude, this defense is brutal. And down he goes. And the clock is steadily counting down. You're right. They need to stop this clock. A quick score is crucial here. You have to earn every inch on this. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Ref side gaming. What's up, buddy? Good to see you. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. This might be it, man. This might be it. No more Kentucky. On to, on to greener pastures. Oh goodness! Oh my goodness! I got lucky. Almost intercepted. Nearly intercepted that time. Oh, on that last play, you see the defense do a good job of playing coverage, and a quarterback telegraphed his pass the whole way. I hope this is okay. So it's second and ten, and this is the ninth. Play this is your song, drive. Sean. No. What's next? I'll show you. After the game, I'll show you. Let's go.
left side. That's awesome about your PC. I just saw you. Line up in a goal line. Ah, I forgot to snap. Here's the call from the referee. Stumpy, I saw your uh, question there. Delay of game on the offense. PS2 Classic game. Um, you're looking at football, basketball, just any sports game. First and 15 now. Ball on their own 38. Here's There's the kind of a hidden gem football game out there, but it's for PS1. He picks up four yards Some of the, the backyard gear. football games are fun, too. Second and 11 coming up. I don't know how interested you are in those, but there's another game. Number 25 is the single Wow, set. that's a game-changing fumble, ladies and gentlemen. And down he goes. And that fumble recovery might give this defense the spark they've been looking for. The game of college football is about emotions, and that could be a huge swing in momentum. A game that, it's not a sports game, but a game that I think you'd be interested in is called the Warriors. And they'll look to capitalize on the good the Warriors position here on PS2. The Kane come out in a bunch for I think you'd have fun with that game. Back Check back. it out. Steps oh, up, goodness. Throws it deep down. Ooh -hoo. So Miami gets a fumble, looking to get on the board. They're at the 33-yard line, so possibly in field goal range. Yeah, Lee, that ball should have been picked off there. Number 18, back in the gun. That's a six. That's six. That's six. Uh oh. Okay, I have one for you, Stumpy. PS2, you're looking for a game. How about this? How about Sega 2K2 with um, Allen Iverson on the cover, I think. Um, NBA 2K6 on PS2. But the Sega, the, uh, the Dreamcast, you know, the, the old Dreamcast version. Um, another one you should look at, maybe NBA Hoops, Hoops, with Shaq on the cover. That one is hours of fun. Another one is Street Hoops. Street Hoops, I think, was probably one of the games I spent the most time on. It's a career or whatever. You play on the circuit. And it's not like unrealistic Street Hoops. It's not, it's, you know what I mean? Some of them Street Hoops games are pretty, like, like NBA Street. Street Hoops I liked a little better because more, a little more realistic. He's been around. I think hot sauce is on that game too. A seven yard run by the running back. The Sega Sports NBA 2Ks, you love those. Those play really well too. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 24 yard line. One man back for you. Yeah, we just can't get anything on the ground. Down he goes. Appreciate, man. 15, 14 people. And I'm trying. I'm trying to get out of here. I just can't. I can't do anything. Ball on their own 26. They line up with trips to the right. That's a first down, right? That's got to be a first down. And down. And that'll be good enough to move the sticks. Yep. Brad, first and 10. This flank or post is a good play here. It's first and ten. Ball in the twenty. Oh, what about uh, bring in their dive game days? He drops back. He's scrambling down the middle. Wow. And that one's going to be great. A good decision here by the quarterback going into coverage. So it's second and ten. I feel like I feel like the Hurricanes are ready to take this game over. They keep it on the ground. Ain't nothing there. And down he goes. The halfback picks up a yard. Um, hey, check out the backyard ones, too. Check out N1 basketball, too, Stumpy. On PS2. Some of those are hard to find, too. Um, oh, uh, the Final Fours. The Final Four has been a game I want to play on the channel forever, but it never wins about. 
Back That's a good quick slant He's right there. First down, all pro tight end. The tight end with a nice catch he will there. be. Mac, you going to NU Colorado? I hope so. I hope so. It's first and ten. I know I have to get me a Dion redeem though. You just pack your bags. I got my own luggage. Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Man. And down he goes. I don't think I've ever laughed that hard. But I like I like Dion. I hope he does well. Second and five coming up here. Ball on their own 45. Number 25 is the single setback. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Jeez, man, I can't get anything going. Final four, Stumpy. Beautiful. You'll love it. Appreciate the thumbs up. Thanks for watching tonight. I really appreciate the support. I really do. Thank you all. And another quick slant. This time Duffy going to pick up the first down. Ref side, if I end up going, then I'll uh, make sure I get a hold of you. Make sure you're on a stream. Or I'll comment on one of your videos. We'll have to meet up. This quarterback has such confidence in his receivers that I don't think he cares what down it is. They're going to make the play for him. Nice. He decides to run I'll take it. I'll take it. I just got to get at least three That's here. The type of run that I tell you, calculate some pass rings. Let me tell you that. 140, 150 pass rate. Running game can get the ball down the field. Ref side, how do you think? Uh, how do you think it's going so far? I mean, we've had a, we've had, we've had, you know, the portal. Portal's interesting, right? I mean, it's crazy. It's a wild, wild west. And he's taken down a five-yard gain. The linebacker from Columbus, who I won't name, Second leaving is here. shocking. Which Final Four is the best one? I love 2004. Number 30, but alone in the backfield. they're all good. Like, I don't think you can go wrong. I like 2004. There. 10 7. A defensive struggle between these two teams. Kentucky. Barely hanging on. Fullback's going to pick up the first down, and that'll end the quarter. Can Kentucky put another one in? I think my secret Santa's trying to get me a game. Oh, tell Santa to get you 2004 Final Four. You can't go wrong, dude. Also, another one, Stumpy, that's really good, is those ESPN, those ESPN versions of uh, NBA on uh, PS2 are really good, too, with... Um, Ben Wallace, Pistons, the Detroit Pistons on the cover. That's a really good game. It's first and ten. This is the 14th play of this drive. I gave you some options. The Wildcats come out in the ace formation. Again, he'll get the call. And he's taken oh, that's down. okay. Yeah, I got, I got lost. I don't even know who redeemed that, that song. Play. Oh, that's a good one, though. Ooh, March Madness, yes. Nah, he couldn't go anywhere because there was no place for him to run. The defensive front got the There's a reason for the sunshine sky. Duffy. So let that feeling grab you deep. Let's go. I'll pause the song.
field. All right, here we go. thought that was a great song number one I thought that was our ball but it's like he just stepped Miami out Miami comes to the line only one man in the backfield drops back to pass here comes the pressure we can't no 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 and let's go that might do it Kentucky turnover on downs for the Hurricanes and they're 241 away from ending a series another one on the channel Kentucky lines up with three receivers. And another championship going to go on the wall. And they Their defense has just come up big to like to it has all season long. Tiger, what's up, man? Welcome in. Appreciate the thumbs up tonight. And again, hey, I thank you guys for following this series. I know it wasn't most the most popular thing I've ever done, but some people say that this is the best NCAA football game of all time, whether you agree or disagree. Pay him. Oh, let's go. Pay that man his money. Let's finish it off. Hand off up the middle. He jukes him. And he's taken down. And they're going to I should be wasting the clock. This clock. I know, Thad. <laughs> Thad's always like, Mac, don't you dare. Don't you dare choke this away. It's third down and four to go. Probably need Along two first downs two. to get out of here. Kentucky comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He drops back, and pumps once. And I'll go. Want to play? Oh, want to play by number seven. And that'll be a timeout for Miami. How did he get out of that one? The Hurricanes are going to take. He ends up getting a first down. First and, ten. and that might be the play of the season because it might just wrap up a national championship. Kentucky comes out with an eye formation. And he's taken down. For the Wildcats. That was their second timeout. Wrench, what's up, man? Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 22. Number 25 lines up in the deep back. High formation. And down he goes. And now the clock will tick. I think Miami's got one timeout left. They do. They're hoping they can stop us here. 
The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful. Oh, you're good, James. James, you got to work tomorrow. On this drive. The cane. Oh, the my time. goodness. Throw a flag. Come up with a sack. The defense calls a timeout. And now I mean, you know what? It doesn't make much sense. Kick, kick three here. This looks like a pretty gutsy call here. Whoa, they might want to reconsider this one. He's got to throw it in a hurry. All right, give him hope. And there goes our quarterback. He looks to be hurt down there. A spike on Colorado Dynasties. That's good timing for mine, then. They'll throw on first down. He steps up. Pick it. To throw oh, my goodness. It falls incomplete. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Congratulations to our old Spice. I know, man. I don't know where he's been, Thad. I don't know where he's been. Pick it, pick it, pick it, pick it. Sack. That's even better. And it looks like they're going to go no huddle here. But then I know it's growing strong. Drops back to back. Steps up in the pocket. Was in the, the spring. And he can't hang on to it. And spring became the summer. Who'd have believed you'd come along? Looks like and they're going to go for it here. Touch him hand. Up. Deep pass down the left side. That'll do it. Finally, a a Kentucky will win the national championship. Let's go. That'll do it, boys. That'll do it. Kentucky gets it done. Touch it more. Hashtag for Jared, man. And I always have to do this because we just do this. Make sure you enter the 1K loyalty point giveaway if you haven't yet. Time to move on to a new game. Something different, something fresh, something I think you guys will like. But real quick, I have to do this because we always do this. If we win a title, you know you've come. How much you want to make a bet? I can throw football, football over, over the, the mountains. mountains. We have to. Kentucky gets it done, 17-7, and they are your national champions. They're going to finish 14 and 0, 9 and 0 in the SEC. We're ranked third in all the polls. The BCS gave us the nod. And that'll be the last you see of 2004, for now, at least. Two years in Kentucky is your national champion. There 
There it is. There's the, there's the Sports Illustrated cover. Gotta love those. So now, that's the end of that one. And again, I appreciate you guys. Um, that have watched this series, another series. Got a lot of them on the channel. And uh, like I said, I know this one wasn't the most popular one out there, but... I did want to play it. I wanted to see what it was all about. It was so much different than I expected in terms of uh, how it was different from NCAA football 04. A lot of different from 04. I, and overall, it's a it's a fun game. You know, in my opinion, I don't know that it I don't know that it even comes close to beating that game. Still think uh, sorry 06. I think 06 is to me the best college football game ever made, and that's why. Very soon on the channel, there'll be more of um, more information about this series. But I think this will be a, this has a chance, possibly, to be the best series I've ever done, and I mean that. It's right here. Choose your destiny, and you know you're probably wondering, Mac, what do, what, what are your what do you got going on here? Well, you know what put my mind to work and uh, I will tell you more when this thing hits uh, basically just a short a short little um, description of kind of what this is is you're going to have a chance to get on one of these teams and I'll explain more when episode one hits this is actually the thumbnail to episode one uh, this is NCAA next. Um, this graphically is going to blow your mind. Um, it looks extremely good. Been playing it. Um, actually, I have sped up the game even a little bit. So speed-wise, this game. Speed-wise, this game is going to shock you. Um, it is NCAA football 2006, but it is obviously updated. 
um, with uniforms. I've also uh, created a couple of my own custom uniforms for this series. But anyway, we're going to have two teams. Long story short for now is I'm going to try to build these two programs from this great state of Colorado. And this was before Dion went to Colorado. So I'm not just doing it because Dion's there. I'm going to be that's been following the channel. This was announced well before Dion took that job. Because I, you've seen me wear, you've seen me wear a Buffs hat. I've kind of been a, a little bit of a Buffalo fan since I was a young kid. Nebraska was always my number one. I always liked the old gold helmets of the Buffaloes. That was always the big rivalry, Nebraska, Colorado. So even though we were supposed to not like them, they were always good. So, and then with Colorado State, the Rams. And uh, the reason I did that, obviously, because we were going to Colorado, and I wanted them both from the great, you know, both from the same state. And uh, Iowa, Iowa State crossed my mind, but we already had Iowa uh, basketball, NCAA 10 on the channel. So that I uh, went against um, West Virginia, Virginia Tech, West Virginia, Virginia. Um, Could have went Florida, Florida State. Thought that was maybe too easy because I wanted to be a little bit of a rebuild job still. Could have went Boise State, Idaho. Um, so I settled on this one, Colorado, Colorado State. Choose your destiny. Long story short, I'm going to try to get these two teams to the national championship to play each other. And I won't stop the series until that happens. And when that does happen and these two teams meet in the national championship, then we will watch and see who is the king of Colorado. And the good thing is it's going to have some subscribers on there, um, some people that support the channel, and et cetera. That will be filling out those squads. So that is the next big thing on the channel. It is this series right here. I do think it'll be a lot of fun. And I'm really pumped and excited about it. So I hope you guys get excited about it. Um, or at least as excited as I am about it. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Um, other than that, um, you know, now I'll be working on trying to finish up Madden. In terms of where we go after Madden, um, I have, I, have, I have a few ideas, a few ideas that you're going to want to keep tuned, uh, tuned into on the channel because with that one, um, we've thrown around a possible idea of doing a WWE 2K22 Fantasy League where me and Little Mac run our own shows and uh, possibly have a draft where anybody can select a wrestler. And then it is a fantasy, fantasy league-based scoring and uh, the person that uh, possibly gets the most points at the end of the season, at the end of the WrestleMania season, will win a complete Batocera retro gaming system uh, full of uh, 10 of your favorite classic games. That is an option. Head Coach 06 is an option. That has been something that uh, people have wanted to see on the channel for a while. So throwing some ideas up there. And uh, seeing what sticks in terms of uh, what's going to follow Madden 23. Because right now, Madden 23, our team is stacked. And I just don't see us losing. So you'll see me start to focus on that a whole lot more. And in the meantime, be thinking about this one. Um, fantasy wrestling is something I haven't seen anywhere out there on YouTube yet. And I think being able to watch weekly shows, you know, it could be 30, 40 minutes. Little Mac will have his show. He's going to book the matches. Um... You know, and I've also thought about this, fellas. I've thought about this in a weird way. Is I'm going to get in touch with some people that I extremely um, have just been supportive of the channel. And uh, you may, you may, um, I don't know. I, I, you know, it would be really cool if, it, if we did the WWE fantasy thing. This would be cool. Is that people that want to draft and be included in this fantasy league to win a killer prize for free. I don't know how else I can do this to get people interested. Is that the is that you guys select your wrestlers. If we were to go this way after Madden 23. Now this choose your next destiny that's happening 100%. It's done in the books. But if we do the other one is that you guys end up I have someone that I can trust that runs you guys picking your wrestlers without me and Little Mac knowing. 
That way, there's no bias anywhere. That'd be pretty cool, right? I just don't know how to. I just don't know how to get that done. So if you have any ideas, let me know. But uh, we do something where we'd have to be in uh, Patreon, Discord, and I would just promise not to look at it, which would not be a big deal. Um, that way, we're booking matches. We have no idea. We have no idea who's winning, which would be great. And we're just picking our favorite wrestlers and uh, trying to book cool matches for you guys to watch, commentating them. Um, Little Mac will have his own belts. I'll have my own belts or title matches, points for title matches. It'd be just it's fantasy, fantasy book wrestling that you can enter literally for free. So, um, I think it'd be a lot of fun. So, I have a lot of ideas. You know, I have a lot of ideas. I will tell you, I feel like the channel's in a dire need of something fun, something to capture attention, something that no other channel is doing. This is where Mac puts his head together and uh, tries to get something good going. So I can't thank you guys enough for all the support. Um, seriously, I will tell you it's been a very, very hard week for me personally and uh, not asking for any sympathy or anything like that. But it's been a, uh, it's been a tough week. Um, a lot of you know I'm a teacher, which has been great. Um, wife's do a twins in about uh, 15 days. I have worked. I'm bad, Let's go. And I'm better than ever. Got a net for making Joey, I got it. You got it, man. Next one, I'll bitch, I'll put you down, Joey. Joey Dynamite donated six dollars and ninety nine cents through super chat. Rem versus Sarah Dynamite versus Coco versus Iron Mouse. Winner faces the champ. I love it. Um, some of you don't know this, and I, you know, I don't like to say this out front. Um, I can't thank you guys enough for supporting the channel. Okay, I just can't. Um, so I've obviously uh, I have a lot of uh, I'm a teacher. I have a lot of uh, students that watch the channel, which is great. Five months. Let's go, Parker. Thank you. Um, so I've been working a weekend job for 12 years, longer than I've been teaching. And uh, for uh, four years, it was my main source of income. That recently, yesterday, told us that it was closing its doors after 24 years of, of, of business. So that one that one hit home. And uh, yeah, if I ever need you guys more, it's more than ever. It's now. So that one's closing its, closing its doors. And um, that was pretty tough news to handle, especially with uh, 10 people that I know very dearly. Um, a lot of them be a lot worse shape than I will be in because there are a lot of older people that live out in the middle of nowhere, and that's their one job that they have. So uh, keep those people in your thoughts and prayers. And tomorrow he's actually trying to meet with uh, a company trying to keep the uh, business alive. So it was a work-at-home gig that I did every weekend and uh, for 12 years. So pretty crazy that they're closing their doors they're great people great people that run that place and uh we serviced uh eight phone companies in the midwest so it was a kick to the gut for a lot of those people and uh one of them is my cousin and some of them are very very good friends of mine they all live out in small small towns maybe out in the, maybe they're some country folk you know they live out in the middle of nowhere so some of them some of them ladies there's 10 of us um five of them are 65 plus years old that uh, don't live within 80 miles of a town. So keep those people in your thoughts and prayers for a company that's uh, possibly going under. Pray that they work. Some, maybe they work a deal out tomorrow. I will say, um, in terms of uh, me, I was, uh, you know, I kind of told the boss. He called. He was upset, crying that this was happening to their company that they had built from the ground up. And I told him, I said, Hey, you know, you know the movie Tommy Boy. I said, you're going to have to sell ice cream to a lady in white gloves tomorrow. So, um, yeah, it was just hard. It's hard when you're having twins and you expect something, and then uh, that that takes a blow to you. So, anyway, it'll be fine. I'm going to rock on. And, uh, you know, it's the way, that's the way life is sometimes. It's always kind of stinky whenever it happens around the holidays, though, you know. That was my hope that it would never nothing like that would ever happen, but... You know what? It's been great for twelve. It's been great for uh, twelve years. It's done a 
it's uh it's been a phenomenal thing and i hope tomorrow when they meet with the uh, head honchos um that they work something out now the crazy story is those of you want to listen if you great if you don't you can log off and again i appreciate watching tonight but they had a uh this is crazy how this stuff works out when it comes to businesses so they had um this company we sir uh we provide technical support um for 10 different phone companies around 10 different phone companies in the midwest uh very local companies um, upwards of maybe, oh, I want to say 2,500 empl- you know, customers. Um, t- I want to say 1,800 customers were with one phone company. Um, and uh, anyway, my boss, I finally heard out the gist of it because they don't tell us, you know, they want to tell us too much without freaking everybody out. But anyway, they were they were basically cutting even. Um, and they had a company that was willing to buy this company out. Uh, based out of Kansas City and that company agreed and they said we're in we're buying it and then our biggest subscriber base that kept this place open heard that we were being bought out and they said no we want local we're out well we're still going to be helping them we were just going to join another group and then the big company said well we don't want to do that we want to just keep you guys because we like local people talking to our customers. So then our biggest subscriber base bounced out. So the company that then bought us backed out because our best and biggest subscriber base was going to leave. So that basically left us in the middle of nowhere to go. The only good thing is, is that said they were going, they were willing to meet tomorrow um, in Kansas City one last time in hopes of saving what they have. And again, it's been 12 years um, so I hope they get something figured out. It'd be a Christmas miracle, but um, sometimes, you know, sometimes it works out for the best too. Sometimes you find something better um, on the side, but sometimes you don't. So either way, you got to figure it out. And again, I appreciate you guys. Had to get that off my chest a little bit because uh, it was. Uh, there's a lot of people out. Uh, I mean, not a lot, but there's nine people that I truly care about that are family to me that uh, will be going through a very difficult time once uh, February hits and if they truly do close the doors on uh, that deal. So hopefully, hopefully that doesn't happen and hopefully tomorrow they can work something out. I I told him, watch Tommy Boy tonight. Go be Tommy Boy. Get on the road and do what you got to do. So hopefully I'll keep you guys updated on that. Um, Anyway, um, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you for the support. We'll be back again. With some Madden 23, we're gonna. I'm gonna focus on knocking that out uh, the best that I can. Um, other than that, that's about it, man. That is about it. Kentucky, they get it done, and they win the national championship, boys. So if you enjoyed NCAA 2004 on this channel, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Make sure you subscribed, and uh, we'll see you guys around, man. Add another title to the wall. I will tell you, I don't have it ready and done because I wasn't quite sure I was going to be. I, Miami's had my number somewhat on this channel. So I was like, eh, Mac, don't be going and making uh, the stream ending championship with Kentucky on there yet. I have to make sure that I uh, won first. And we did. Appreciate it, Sean. Thanks for the nice comment. And uh, appreciate the uh, donations from uh, Joey Dynamite, James Madalena, Andre for sniffing out that title like he always does. And again, make sure you keep an eye out for that NCAA Next series. I think it's going to be fire. As uh, far as uh, what we do after Madden, we'll keep our options open. Sounds good. You guys have a good night, man. Thanks, everybody. Appreciate the likes. Man. That was crazy. That was a good night. That was one of the better nights we've had in a long time. That gives me a boost of energy. Good night, y'all.